Ladies and gentlemen, it's me, James Finney, coming at you this Thursday afternoon from the balcony overlooking the floor of the New York Stock Exchange. And you know exactly what time it is. It's nearly 4 o'clock. The markets there are about to close. I'm feeling good. Still have one more day left until the weekend. Let's get it started. It's happy hour in the Big Apple. Now, U.S. equities trading lower this Thursday as retailers, they concluded their earnings season. Shares of Walmart falling by more than 2.3% in early trade, despite the company posting better than expected quarterly results. L Brands also reporting results that beat expectations for the company, lowering its 2017 earnings per share guidance, sending the stock down by more than 7%. Overall, calendar second quarter earnings They've been a mixed bag for retailers, Nordstrom posting better than expected earnings and sales, sending its stock higher, while sales for Macy's topped expectations, but investors sending the stock lower after those results came out. At the same time today, Wall Street contending with the fallout from President Donald Trump, dissolving two advisory forums comprised of top U.S. CEOs. The disbanding comes amid backlash against Trump growing, following remarks he has made following the violent protest in Charlottesville, Virginia. Meanwhile, in economic news, weekly jobless claims falling to a seasonally adjusted 232,000 from 244,000 and U.S. factory output falling in July as auto production fell off. And with the euro falling from a, two and a, half, a near two and a half year high against the dollar after a summary from the European Central Bank's July 20th meeting showed officials were concerned about an overshooting in the currency. And you have yourself a session right now with the Dow Jones continuing to seek a direction. Let's take a look right now to see where the markets have closed. And with that stated, kick back, relax. I'll see you guys all tomorrow morning for Modern Wall Street saying we're almost there, almost at the weekend. I'm James Swinney.